long lasts, we can now upload custom background music to our live streams. Let me show you how to do that. Take action now. Hi, my name is Desiree. If you're looking to grow your business with better social media and content marketing, take action now. Hit that subscribe button and the bell below. Now, why would you need to have background music in your live stream? You ask, I'm so glad that you did. The benefits of adding music is going to be that you can kind of set a tone for your live stream. Like maybe you're talking about something really exciting and peppy and like the, the tone of the music adds that sort of flair to it. Or maybe you were just trying to like having a more somber, serious studying sort of situation by having that kind of music, it sets the tone. You can use these in a lot of different situations, whether it's an interview, whether you're doing a demonstration of something, whether you are doing prompts for a course or a class that you are teaching through StreamYard. There are so many uses for background music that like it just sets a great tone and I love it so much. But where are you supposed to get these awesome music? Like not everyone is a composer that can make their own music. You are going to want to check out Soundstripe. I have a link for you down in the description below that you can use to get started and it's just really easy to use. You just sign up, you download your music you want to use and it's royalty free. So you can use these in your streams and on your videos royalty free so you're not going to get copyright claims so you're able to monetize that content and get money. I have done this myself and it works beautifully. Like so it's very easy to use. So now let me show you how to use over in StreamYard over on the computer. So when you're wanting to add your own custom background music to your stream, all you do is go over to the right hand side and you're going to go to brands. And now if you're going to scroll down to the bottom, you'll see background music as one of your options. What is really great about StreamYard is that they include a lot of st like standard ones like that you can use on your own like they provide for you. And then of course they have this loop option. But how you can add your own is go here to add music. Now you can just go into here and hit add music select the file that you want and then you will have it available for you to play as you can see it is processing and it is here now if you're wondering where can I go so that I can get really good custom background noises rather than using these different ones maybe I want like a music or set a mood or something like that you can go to Soundstripe as the best place to get going you can check them out with the link I have in the description down below all you have to do is kind of pick your mood pick your vibe pick like your genre that you're trying to go into so like we can just click inspirational and then we can see kind of like these different sounds that we have available for us to use um, and then also they also provide videos as well if you want to just search for something specifically you can just go and do inspiration and it's going to pull up different things and you can kind of see these different audios that they have they highlight their newest ones here at the top and then you can just kind of listen to one see what you hike and they are designed to be able to loop. So you can check them out with the link I have in the description down below. And when you are ready to go, as you can see ours over, over here, we can rename it. That's how it's like. Um, I'm using this for a live stream I'm doing today. And I can just have it in the background of my live stream. I can turn it up or down here. And then I also can set it to loop so that it will play. Or if I only want it to listen to the end of the song, I can just turn it off and turn it on. And so I have this to play when I'm doing something. So my intention is to have this playing while I am doing some drawing. So now again, you can check out Shane for free that I have for you linked down in the description below. But if you are wanting to know more about the features that are available to you in StreamYard, watch this video that I have for you right here where I list every single feature that's currently available on StreamYard. And you'll be surprised at how many there are.